The link down below has been replaced, but I still urge you to head to the link below, educate yourself, and consider supporting Ukraine financially. All the sources down there have been vetted. Your money will go to the right place. Okay, so that in there. People. It's moving. It might be a tree, though, so uh, stand by. This might be a really short episode. You'll be able to tell by the video timer if it's a short or long episode. There's a door. All right. People hanging out, hiding in the old greenhouse. Or something. Again, could just be branches swaying in the... Swaying from the fans or something. Ultraviolet light. Okay. Someone's definitely still growing plants up here. A lot of plants. Okay, they overgrew uh, everything. So, what was uh, what was the thinking here? Why did we uh, let nature get out of control? Someone playing a guitar. Is that normal? That doesn't look normal. That don't look normal. What do you got, drone friend? You find the guy playing the guitar? <sighs> oh, good lord, I hate these. Maybe it's on this side. Yes, yes it is. Doing it twice! Ah, oh, God, I hate this. Ugh. There we go. Okay. I just spoke to Remco. He says the yield is unsalvageable. How did we not catch this new mutation? How... How long until the ration plan is back on track? <sighs> Never. I think... We need to completely reevaluate our projections. With the heating coils out and no alloy from Herschel, we're already purifying water 35% slower than before and... That's not a lot. So, now you've finally gone completely mad. I just... Rosa is fighting her own feelings of guilt and shame. That's why she started Homewood. She thinks it'll redeem all the tough choices she had to make on the moon. Mighty brave Rosa operates out of fear and ego, just like the rest of us. Uh-huh. Do you remember the Antarctic catastrophe? I was there. I'm the only survivor left. Our second attempt at a self-sustained biosphere, and we destroyed it in less than three years. Because of pointless arguments, 
petty squabbling. Intelligent, sane people devolved into stupid, irrational cavemen. Tell me this, Isaac. Why does emotion always triumph over pragmatism? Why were our last years on Earth accompanied by endless wars over resources? Because we were running out. Why can't humanity ever work in unison? Because you're a madman. are and always will be too selfish to do what needs to be done. Soon, Earth will be just as uninhabitable as Mars. Because of us. No, because of you. Or the bees, nor the cancer cells that spread through my wife like wildfire. We did that. Oh, this is about your wife now? We will persevere and we will succeed. Outward was working. Outward is working. The chaos she breeds will end it all. You understand that, don't you? Yes. Then explain to me, Isaac, why you helped her with her psych ward and why you spend time socializing with her. Because we it need psychiatric choose, help. Isaac, which side you are actually on. It's not about science. Rose and I are good friends. The you don't get to sit on the fence about this. Uh, I outward think he does. Or Earth, Isaac. I'm here for Outward, William. You know that. I don't give a damn about Earth. Now, you're just saying that, uh... <laughs> now, we know that's a lie. We know that's a lie. Because he's just saying that to uh, make it so that he doesn't hurt him. How do we get up there? I think we could jump off of this over here. One sec. Uh, or we could just use these. There we go. <sighs> Up. Yeah, we should probably call our teammates. Tell them we think we saw something, but turns out it was nothing. Okay, hang on. I think I missed something up there. Or maybe we can just leave. Yeah, that was the correct course of action, I think. I remember when you said that before. Oh, well, now what the heck am I doing? Goodbye, moon man. We say goodbye.